Hey everybody, and welcome back to the Cabillion stream. Uh, earlier, you may have seen that Cabillion was streaming, but that was a joke, a, a very silly, funny joke. It was haha -ha funny, and it was totally not an accident that I was streaming earlier, but it was a joke. The on purpose joke. <laughs> so thank you so much, everyone. Um, this is, uh, I wanted to show something a little brand new. So those of you who have done any art in our Cabillion Discord, I'm gonna be updating our little slideshow here, over there, you see Captain's uh, Transformer right there, and uh, a few, <laughs> yes, sure, it's an on purpose accident. Uh, there's another one of Captain's right there. So if you guys want to put any art into our Discord, I'm going to put it up. I'm going to show it off because I'm proud of you guys. You guys, uh, if you do art based on our Cabillion characters, obviously. This is a Cabillion channel, so it's got to be Cabillion stuff. So Juan definitely knows what's up with Cabillion. And I know that I said this month is going to be request month. And yes, even Soul Calibur, it's, is that Cabillion? <laughs> But unfortunately, something happened today, and I have been put on a high priority other item, and so I can't do requests today, but next week, Friday, I will do only requests. I swear, I promise. It was it was the Overlord. It, there's just a high priority item that I have to get to today. Actually, two high priority items. And actually, I will be um, doing all the fan requests next week, Friday. I apologize. I am so sorry. But it was either not stream at all or sh stream but show you guys the high priority stuff that I'm doing. So, <laughs> so what's going on is um, I need to make some key art for Netflix. Um, and I need to make some stuff from Netflix and then the other high priority item I'm gonna do offline um, but we're going I'm gonna show you um, so you know Netflix or Hulu or whatever when you go onto their website you see a bunch of images those are key art um, so I had to get screen grabs for each episode I had to um, take the logo and put it in various formats um, including one with a background um, so Netflix has like all of this um, all of these checklists basically and very particular specs and so i just delivered the screen grabs and i delivered the logo and now i'm going to be gathering character poses and making some key art so i'm going to be showing you i'm going to be working on a show called oh yuck it's actually phenomenal like no joke love yeah rules and guidelines so they have documents upon documents i have three documents alone just talking about the key art in at you know about like what I need to deliver at Netflix like three separate documents um, <laughs> so um, I just delivered those and now you're gonna see how I'm making the key art um, and uh, this show is basically about this guy right here um, he is named Septico he has a teammate um, who is this chick who I started uh, cutting out um, pristine uh, McLean or something like that. I don't know their names very well. I kind of watch the shows on mute because <laughs> I have to like scrub through and it sounds like a chipmunk yelling at me <laughs> when I uh, leave the sound on. Um, yeah, and he's like, he loves gross stuff. He loves um, like science and mold and how things work. And then his, you know, this chick who's also uh, working in the same place as him is all about clean. And uh, then they have this robot over here who was built and he's really cool. And there's other characters and other things. And you can check out this show on, on Pavilion. Um, I can watch uh, it's on Netflix. It's not on Netflix yet. We need to deliver this stuff. Um, Linz is cutting people. <laughs> yeah, I'm cutting them real bad, real bad. Oh, hey, what's up, Nerd News? And thank you for helping me out earlier. Um, so we've changed the stream to do key art stuff because that's high priority right now. So we're going to get into that. Um, so I watched the episode. I grabbed a bunch of uh, screen grabs that I thought would work and I'm just kind of putting them together. So we're just gonna hang out a little bit and um, I'll show you what I started with. I found this background and I erased what was in the center. Then I um, extended it out, as you can see. Uh, then I grabbed a couple of bubbles that I found. 
um, and put them down, which I'm probably gonna move around. Uh, then I found uh, a good image of the robot here. Uh, a pretty good image of Septico. So I'm gonna have to be tweaking things and moving stuff around. Um, but I'm gonna add the girl, uh, Pristine. I'm gonna add her, uh, let me just add some stink bombs. So yeah, you can see, uh, I'm just trying to make things kind of stinky and, and gross. But not too gross because I don't I don't I want people to actually click on it. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's kind of what's going on right now. So you'll kind of see me working on that. And uh, once again, I apologize for for not streaming uh, what we planned on. But it was either do this or not stream. <laughs> I don't know what Soul Caliber is though. Cabillions of man's robots in the contract. Yes. Your beard is large, I saw it. When you came out of your garage, it was like you were in there for like three months. Can you darken the bubbles so closer to the green on his shirt? Yes. I'm gonna first lay down the characters and then I'm gonna tweak stuff. Um, but yes, and you guys, you know, you are our audience. You will be clicking on this stuff. So I'm down to hear uh, feedback. Um, so I started uh, cutting her out, um, but I don't like all of the uh, reflections and shines on here. Because right now it's like zooming into stuff that is, uh, that used to be in the background. So actually, let me show you. So, she used to be in a background. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is uh, take away some of these shines and stuff and uh, make it a little more realistic to the new environment that we're putting her in. That's what we doing. Yeah, we'll add boogers, sure. <laughs> From COVID-19. Um, so I did have to go to the uh, doctor today uh, for like a usual checkup thing. And they still let me go. They still said that was cool. Like, don't worry about it. I'm like, okay. Um, and uh, when I went, I'll show you, they gave me this. They gave me an actual mask. <laughs> I can't put it on because I have headphones on, but now I have an official mask. All you have to do is go to the doctor. I did. I did brave it. It was weird. It was weird being in the doctor's office, but I actually felt really safe because when I drove in, um, they had two... They had one line when you drive in and it splits off in two directions. When you go to before the split, they ask you and they're like, hey, um, they ask you a bunch of questions. Have you been sick? Have you been traveling in the past 30 days, etc." I said, no, and I'm feeling fine and everything. Then they took my temperature by putting a thermometer in my ear and um, it was fine. It was 97.6 or something. And then they're like, okay, drive to the right. And um, they gave me the mask and uh, gave me a sticker and they took down my information, like my cell phone number, my name and everything. And um, I, I felt like really safe. Everyone in there it, in the office was all wearing masks. They were all wearing gloves. It was, it was actually, I, I, felt, um, I, I felt actually really safe being in there. I, I was kind of like, can I just stay here? I know it's good in here. Uh, don't want to go to the doctors. Oh yeah, nice uh, new emote, Captain. Those uh, just got activated if you um, do two-factor authentication. The temple check? I don't, I don't know that one. Yeah, those are cool. I like the sword. Throwback Tuesday or Thursday. <laughs> yeah, what is, why, I hate how my hair just like, what is this little thing that's, my hair just sticks up like that, it's so weird. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> so uh, that was an interesting thing that I had to go through. Um, but if anything goes down, I'm heading over to the doctor's office and that's where I'm gonna be hanging out. They've got vending machines and stuff. That's where I will be. <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. The Knights of Cabillion. 
<laughs> yeah, I don't know why, uh, like, d do those emotes have anything to do with the virus? Like, you know, here's a helmet and shield and you're doing two factor authentication. So it's like extra protection and shields are protection. So is there, is, are they trying to be clever? So I'm gonna turn this to screen and I'm gonna drop down the opacity a little bit. And then I'm gonna make a new layer. And we're gonna get rid of some of these. I'm gonna use the stamp tool. So you guys must have thought, oh, Lindsay, she only works in Illustrator. She doesn't know any other program. Well, that's not totally true. <laughs> Ah, thanks, Nerd News. I know at least a few other programs. <laughs> um, I think I actually want to do this a different way. We are one important thing when you are working with uh, image correction is uh, make sure that you can always go back to the original. It's super important. Because you never know if you're in the middle of something and you're zoomed in really close and then you zoom out and then you realize, oh, what? Oops, <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. So it's always good to have a backup of what you're doing. Is one Instagram, is one Twitch. <laughs> yeah, Netflix is, is a program, totally. Uh, love to dance Togepi. Aww, I like Togepi too. He's a cutie. I'm limited, yeah. I do like to watch uh, shows though when I work. Um, lately, I've been watching um, mystery, like documentaries on uh, famous people in history. Actually, today is April 3rd, obviously, and it marks the. Um, uh, this is gonna, I'm sorry for saying it, but the, the Unabomber was actually captured on a Friday, April 3rd, years ago. So I don't know if you guys are even old enough to know who or what that is, but uh, it's the anniversary of his capture. And I was just watching his documentary. And uh, it's amazing how science, technology, and even how documentaries have changed um, over the years. Like, sometimes they have to redo documentaries because new information has come out. But then there's shows like Gumby, where it came out in the, what, the 60s, the 50s, etc. And stop motion, no need, no need to change. It's all good. But certain CGI, like, I don't know if you've ever watched the show Reboot. There's been rumors of uh, people saying they're gonna reboot the show Reboot, uh, but that was one of the early CGI shows, and watching that now, oh my god, it's really bad. <laughs> I'm gonna leave some sparkle in my eye. Gotta leave some eye sparkle, you know? Yes, fam, uh, the request will be next week, Friday. I will do only fan requests, and I once again apologize, but work um, comes first. It was either not stream or, like, stream uh, what I'm actually doing for, for what I need to do, and that's what's do. And I wanted to stream with you guys. What is with this brush? This hairbrush is killing me here. There we go. I'm like super all up in this eye. Watch out. Turn down the softness and the opacity and just kind of give it a hit.
How many points do I need to spend to get Linz in the shark onesie? We actually need to reset uh, our cheer goal thing. I was uh, thinking, um, I spoke with the team and maybe there's something we can do to um, the group of us. We'll have a stream where it's all of us in the onesies. <laughs> but as for a single person in the onesie, that's a really good question. Um, we haven't talked about that. Cool, 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 cool. Let's see if this works. So, okay, put her there. Let's see how this looks. Put her behind Septico. Take this, scale it down. And let's, uh, scale down these guys a little bit. <laughs> yeah, she's funny. Septico, make bigger. <laughs> Move this over so it's first is more in the center. All the points? <laughs> Asking for a friend. Uh, I'm, I don't have any masks here, here, so I couldn't do that anyways. My doctor's mask? I can't wear it on my headphones. 5,000. <laughs> Onesie funsy. Aw, you guys. So I can see that I need to turn the opacity down a little more on this. Yeah, that's better. And I need to uh, actually remove this as well so it matches. I would you know, I was watching another streamer and uh, they were just looking at YouTube videos with people on their stream. And actually Ligma has made some really amazing YouTube videos. Um, so I was thinking um, it would be really cool if we did something like that, where we watch uh, some of our really weird YouTube videos with you guys. <laughs> go. Needs to be white. Yeah, that's better. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, he does have a onesie, he confirmed. <laughs> Cute emotes one. Crunchyroll? Oh, cool. I didn't know Crunchyroll has a, uh, a Twitch channel. Hey, got the thing there. Yeah, it would be fun. Yeah, into the mind of Ligma, in a way. I haven't talked to her about it yet. <laughs> But if everyone says they want it, how can how can Ligma deny you? Outvoted Ligma, yes. I think we did. Ligma, we're making you do a new show. <laughs> Actually, I don't like this bubble. It's leading eyes off of the page. That's so weird. Dun. And I don't like this bubble just sitting on top of his head like that. Yeah, I think that's looking cool. Cute. So we have these gas bubbles. Mm -hmm. 
Now let's put some, what do we call the steam. We can get a partnership. Golden Dorothy? Goldeen! Oh, Goldeen! Ooh. Yes, you are. Uh, Lig Ligma, I want to do a segment where um, we have you maybe on a green screen, I'm not sure. But anyways, there will be the, the weirdest YouTube videos that you have made. I want to do a playlist and I want to just kind of show everyone these YouTube videos while we're streaming and uh, kind of just talk about them and like... Okay. I think we're in. Did we, are we still alive? Was that just a hiccup? Yeah. Okay. We made it. We only missed. Uh, we only dropped 739 frames. <laughs> it says we're alive. Sorry, guys. <laughs> uh, false alarm. We still held on somehow. But uh, yeah, Ligma, I want to make a playlist of your favorite weirdest YouTube videos that you made. I want them playing big on the screen and I want you in front of it on a camera and I want to like, we'll hang out with you and talk with you as your, as like how you made these uh, weirdest YouTube videos on the internet. <laughs> Not opposed? All right. We'll do that when we can get back in the studio, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> uh, we never know. So now I'm gonna make some shadows to like make him stand out a little bit. So paint with black, filter, blur. We're gonna Gaussian blur this. Yes, in there. Then multiply and bring down the opacity. Just to kind of make him stand out a little bit. Like, oh ho ho! What is that over there? Mm hmm. Stream from inside the computer. Oh, that's cool. Oh, God. Okay, are we safe again? I think we're safe again. Someone draw Sanic drinking tea. <laughs> there we go, thank you, Just Informed. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know what's up with the stream today. Actually, you know what, I'm gonna do a little modification here. I see my face. I wanna zoom in on this a little. Let's, let's, uh, let's get a little personal, guys. Let's get a little up close. Let's get like a smidge bigger here. I, mean, I just want to be closer to you guys. How's that? <laughs> just wanted to come closer. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay, I'm... Um... Okay, we're going to... Right now it feels like they are really cut out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab these three characters. And put them in a group. so I can easily paint on top. So I'm just gonna add a little uh, like highlight shadow thing going on. And see if that looks okay. Just to have them kinda fit in with the background a little more. Just a little bit. Let's see. Wow, I should not use screen. We're using a different effect. Brush, just do normal. Okay. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Hey, 
so good to see you. We're having a little bit of stream issues, so I apologize. Seems like the internet doesn't want me to stream today. Also, um, obviously this isn't, uh, what's it called? It isn't a fan request right now because work has a high priority that I need to do. So we're doing that on stream. So we're making key art for uh, this show that will be on Netflix. So yeah, just by adding just a little bit of that. <laughs> oh, thank you. So, hey, Linz has been saving. Yes, I think. Now I have. <laughs> um, yeah. So we're just adding a little bit. Just adding a little bit to her. Filter, blur, gaussianer. Hey. What is going on here? Filter, blur, gaussianer. So this is another part of my job, not just making fan art. <laughs> if you all were wondering, what else does Lindsay do besides fan art? So you can see the difference, how hard lined it is there, and then now it's just, it feels a little softer, and it feels a little more in the environment. I'm gonna try uh, what some of these other things. too rough on some of these other filters. So we're just going to keep it normal. Now let's do the same thing to the robot. And also check out down below for those of you who have submitted art into our Cabillion discard. This card. Discord. Discord. I'm uh, showing it off because I'm proud of y'all. Thank you, soul. Here come that boy. Rolling down the street. <laughs> Gazian bow. And opacity 48. And now, last but not least, Susceptico. So with him, I actually had to paint some of his hair and uh, because just cropping his hair out of a screen image was really uh, basically impossible. So <laughs> what I did was uh, I just painted his hair, just parts of it. So yeah, so check out without it, how how harsh it is, and then with it, it just kind of feels like it fits more in the environment a little more. Okay, so this is one, this is one version. We're gonna make a couple of them. So imagine this on Netflix. <laughs> and Netflix will probably change my design. The, these probably aren't gonna be the final versions, but um, we have to deliver them layered art and uh, they format it to all the different sizes and things. Uh, only, a bald spot only because I probably cut him out weird, but he, he shouldn't have a bald spot. <laughs> oh no, where's my drink? There it is. <laughs> Here come that boy rolling down the street. Down the street. Down the street. Come on. <laughs> no, he has very luscious, amazing hair. What's cool about this show is it's not just live action. It's also animated. Let me show you some screen grabs. Um, I was, I actually, there was one episode that was all about poop. 
and I was told by the masters that I'm to, to remove all of the screen grabs that actually had poop in them. So since these cannot go on Netflix, I'm gonna show you some of the screen grabs that were denied. Here is Septico flying on his toilet in the sky with a poop. Uh, that was denied. Um. <laughs> yeah, let me find the other one that was denied. Oh, uh, this one here. Uh, Septico checking out this prized poop with magnifying glasses. Look at it, it's glorious. I don't think, poop can't have, like this must be rhino poop. <laughs> yeah. And let's see, the other one that was denied. Where's the other one? Oh, this one was denied. So uh, this, is, this show has live action. It has live action puppets. It has animation. This show is amazing. Um, this was a, a Viking, one of the guests uh, over here. Uh, he, he was on the, the episode and there was a animated segment. Um, but yeah, that got denied. Um, and also, uh, this is just a funny one, but I didn't submit this one because I don't like he's, that he's not looking at camera. It's not a really good screen grab. But this was denied as, as well. I denied this one on purpose. <laughs> so this was just one episode about poop. I know, it was, yeah, it was a, it's a lot of, a lot of poop. Um, so this is one key art. Now let's save a new document. Call it number two. <laughs> number two. Get it? Number two. <laughs> uh, you guys. You guys. We gotta have fun here. Gotta have some fun. Some good time fun fun. Yeah. <laughs> so much poop. But love for poop. I know. <laughs> There's only a, like, there's a few great things in the world. Like, your first time at Disneyland. Like, I don't know, petting a soft puppy, soft fluffy puppy who was just born. Um, you know, there's like few beautiful things in the world that are amazing. But sometimes just having a really good poop can be one of those feelings. <laughs> Okay, so now I'm looking at some screen grabs. Um, I also grabbed some uh, elements. I'm gonna. So I like this uh, this texture that I found. I think I found it from an episode. I'm not sure. So I know I want to do something with this, and uh, I liked this uh, image as well. I think it shows some of the nerdy sciencey things about it so mr rogers never did a special about enjoying poop well mr rogers come on now <laughs> yes there are there is such thing as enjoying a poop what is this okay so i really recommend you guys checking out this show uh because um, you learn a lot. It's actually a, a learning show. It won awards um, in Australia, but humor in America is like very different than humor in the rest of the world. So it's weird. Like some people just don't get it how like amazing the show is, and it's like really frustrating because this is such a good show. It kind of reminds me of like the days of uh, Ren and Stimpy where it's like only a s certain people like got how humorous Ren and Stimpy were. Well, this is one of those shows. Jump on it, everyone. Jump on it. So, like I said how this show is live action and animated, I'm still trying to think of an idea of how to combine showing live action and animated in a cohesive way. And I have an idea, but we'll see. 
The thing about key art is it's gotta be eye-catching and really basic at the same time. Which is kind of weird, but... There's just, it's next to so many images, you want it to stand out. Yeah, it is a specific genre. He would though if PBS would allow it, yeah. Test the strobe. <laughs> I like body humor. Yeah, totally soul. And uh, I think this show does it really well. And plus, since they have a character that is called Pristine, you know, I think her name is called Pristine. Um, like I said, I don't really listen to the episode because I have to scrub through them to get screen grabs and images, and it sounds like a chipmunk is yelling at me. So I mostly uh, turn off the volume um, when I'm scrubbing through. But she, she's a really cool character, too. So there's, there's also cleanliness in it as well. But when I think about key art, not everything has to come from the show. Like, you know, for an example, this guy likes gross stuff. So at one point I was like, okay, well, I want cockroaches on the page. I want like bugs to be walking on the page. Um, so like I just went online and I just grabbed uh, images of cockroaches. You're not limited to only what is in the show. You just have to use your imagination. And make it feel like it was in the show. No, no epilepsy. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the lurk nerd news. No seizures, please. Yeah. I used to have a uh, setting on my uh, hue light. It was a party setting. Let me see if I can turn that on. It's been a while since I've uh, activated it. Let me see. Where is it? I think it's Hue Labs. Ah, uh, here we go. Agreed. I think it's this. Is it changing? Oh, here we go. So the lights just change. Now it's yellow. <laughs> Here come that Grover rolling down the street. Ooh, what are you gonna eat, uh, just informed? What's that? Yo, Young Khan, what's up, man? Thank you so much. For those of you who do not know Young Khan, check him out. He does amazing art, all while keeping a perfect beard and uh, sipping coffee in one hand. It's a sight to see. Uh, he does a lot of um, stuff for emotes, so you'll see him do stuff from video games. Um, he is a true professional, plays the best music, and I love lurking in his channel. So thank you so much for the uh, <laughs> for, for uh, coming over here, Khan. For those of you who don't know me, this channel is actually Kabillion TV On Demand. Uh, we're a free TV network that we've all been sent home <laughs> from the network and I'm actually streaming from my apartment because I still wanted to stream with you guys. Um, this show, Oh Yuck, is going to be on Netflix. Um, so I'm just showing some of the things that I'll be doing. So I just uh, put one piece of key art together and we're just going through and I'm showing people how I go about creating the key art and the type of deliveries that Netflix um, has. So, uh, welcome. We do all types of stuff. Um, you can even see some of the people uh, in our Kabillion Discord have uh, made some fan art of some of the characters we have for our kids' show. And uh, I'm putting them on here. So every Friday I'm here doing art. I usually do fan art of our show, but we have an emergency delivery of stuff. So I'm here working on uh, a Netflix delivery. 
and um, uh, we usually show our shows, like binge watch, and we usually binge watch with you guys. But our schedule's kind of up in the air right now since a lot of the entertainment business stuff, uh, we have to work from home, so it's kind of, yeah, emergency. We need these shows on Netflix. Um, but Young Khan, thank you. I appreciate it. And please, please check out Young Khan. He's phenomenal. He'll stop his stream. Someone will have a question. He'll straight up stop and he'll just show exactly all the secrets. Everything's out. Um, he also has some amazing words of wisdom that he puts on his Twitter. Uh, so I highly recommend you guys check him out. And thank you. Thank you, everyone, all the Raiders who have come through. Um, we do all kinds of stuff, so you never know. We're kind of just like, yeah, you never know what, what's what's going on. We have shows like Yu-Gi-Oh! 5D, Pokemon. Um, I'm not really good with naming all the shows. Uh, Gumby, uh, <laughs> Bobby's World, uh, all types of stuff. Paid advertisement, yeah. I, I can't get enough of Young Khan. I, I am always lurking. He may or may not know that. So yeah, this was one version of the key art, and uh, what we do is we deliver the layered um, artwork to um, Netflix, and then they change it into the different, all the different sizes and formats that they uh, need it in. So they'll change it to um, vertical, they'll change it to all the different sizes, but the document that we get from Netflix <laughs> is like so strict and so, in so complicated, it's... A lot of information. I literally have three PDF documents just talking about the asset delivery. It's it's a lot. <laughs> Creeping. Oh yo, barely. What's up, my man? Yo yo yo. I see some familiar faces. Um, so yeah. I so what I had to do is sometimes I just get a feeling. I'm like, you know what? I like this texture just because it it is it is in the show or isn't in the show. It doesn't matter. It's what what translates to the vibe of the show and what will people click on? And key art has to be very simple. So I went through and I had to do a delivery of three screen grabs uh, per episode. Uh, and I, while I was doing that, I also decided to take a couple of screen grabs uh, that I can take some possible art from. Usually we do a photo shoot with you know, ideally we would have a photo shoot with uh, the actors, but this was done in Australia. And even though I asked for it, I asked like every day for months, like, please give me marketing photos, please give me marketing photos. Um, they weren't really able to deliver on that. So now I'm stuck getting screen grabs, but hey, that's the way it works. You know, that's the way it is sometimes. <laughs> But your boss will be like, uh, ah, well, make it happen. And then you just gotta make it happen. Um, so unfortunately he has really crazy hair and uh, extracting that is insane. Usually they'll shoot on a green screen um, and then I'll be able to more easily extract, but that's not the way things worked this time. Um, so what I have to do is I have to do the best I can with what I got and then I will actually just take like a hairbrush or whatever and um, I'll just kind of paint his hair and I actually I don't know if I want to remove the green or if I'm gonna change it to blue so it fits better in this area or I can just take this green background and then it will fit even better so we'll see we'll see how that goes Australia boomerang yeah a masking nightmare it is I mean his hair is amazing I wonder what product he uses but oh god it's it's a lot of work and uh, I was gonna be doing fan cabillion fan requests today but unfortunately um, this was a high priority thing I had to do so that's what we're doing That's, that's what's up. Um, yeah, so thank you guys for hanging out. Let's multiply. So what's, uh, you know, I'll, I'll kind of talk about some, 
stuff that I will do with the brush. Like if you go into your color dynamics, you can change the foreground and background jitter to happen. So if you have two colors, I will show you. Why isn't it working? Pen pressure, 50-50. Oh, I think my lights are tripping me up. Working on vectorizing that Henner image I made myself for merch. Very cool, Barely. Yeah, do what you gotta do, man. Yeah, people can lurk, people can show. I have no problem with that. I'm usually a lurker myself. So yeah, it's just try to make it fit. Try to try to make it work. Dun 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 dun. I want to know, maybe it's this type of brush. But yeah, you just have to blend it and ugh, it sucks. Sometimes I'll go into the mask and then I'll change my brush shape for the angle to be with the pen tilt. And then I can turn it around and then I can do things like that. Actually, it's probably best if I... Oops. Play around with the brush this way. Gosh, rotate you. There we go. So there never is one easy brush that it's like, oh yeah, I'll just remove this whole character, no problem. Yeah, That's, that doesn't exist. Next week I'll do fan art. I really wanted to do fan art today. I had a whole wheel set up. I got all your guys' requests from Discord. Sad, sad moment, I'm sorry. I know it's a lot of work and luckily key art for Netflix isn't that big so it doesn't have to be too crazy but it still is kind of annoying if only they gave me the marketing images that I requested way early on but no <laughs> poses Septico. So I'm also saving poses as I'm going along. 
I'm gonna deliver that separately as well. Let's see. Selective color. some of the green there. on this is cheaper than the actor yes it is <laughs> is this the splash screen that pops up when you're browsing in uh in nf when you're browsing in nf what's nf is that my other nf nf oh netflix yes thank you Yes, um, basically I'm making a few different key arts in horizontal to give to Netflix so they can adjust it and do their sparkle to it and then they um, will format it to the different, yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's the key art, so you know when you go to netflix.com and you see all those thumbnails? That, that's what this is. So I've only done one so far, oh, oops. So I've done this one and I kind of talked through how I did this one and uh, adding, you know, uh, kind of like really light blurred uh, highlight around each character so it doesn't look like they're so chopped up and um, so this is one. Um, so I, I really liked this background so I'm, I'm doing another thing with the, this background. And part of the stuff I was sort of saying was um, you don't really um, need to take things exactly from the show. You just need to find the vibe of it. We all enjoy the puke green. I know the blue will probably make more sense, but um, I just want to see what this looks like. And also will be an easier job for me. <laughs> so this is set to go. Because it's already green and if there's a little bit of a green highlight on his face then it actually fits in kind of well and key art is kind of interesting because it has to be very simple but also tell a story or at least get people to click on it yeah cute green I mean, I like the blue. I can change this highlight to blue, but this is like very green. It's like too dark in certain points. Um, yeah, maybe it should be blue. But this blue is crazy. We're gonna have to mess with this blue. Let's change the curves on this. And I would love to tell you guys, like I know exactly what I'm doing. But really, being an artist is kind of going with your feelings. And you kind of just have to experiment. You, you know, a lot of the times the thing that's in my head is not the thing that it ends up being. And it ends up being better. Um, you just have to play around with settings and um, just kind of test things out. You don't always have to know what you're doing. You just have to have curiosity, know your programs to a certain extent, and um, experiment and enjoy it. 
and keep thinking in your head if i was a kid i am a kid we're all kids would i click on this like that's the number one thing being able to separate yourself from the artwork so you have to keep switching hats you have to be like i am the cons i'm the consumer am i going to click on this is this awesome enough yet can i make this more awesome and then like okay i'm the designer now what can i do to solve this problem i still <laughs> yeah just informs our editor yeah exactly nobody knows what they're doing if someone says they know what they're doing it's an absolute lie <laughs> They might have a general idea, but once they get into it, it's like, oh, I didn't think of this, or they'll do a mistake, and they'll it'll inspire them to do something else. I'm like, oh, you know what? I kind of like that. I'm gonna explore that. Do you guys like this colored background? It's tripping me out. We're gonna go back to green. This is too much. <laughs> this is like too much green here. I mean, it's too much color changing. It's tripping, tripping me out. Accidental masterpiece. Yeah, totally. Totally. So I like this grunge that's on the wall. I think we're going to add some splat behind him. Let's put a shadow behind the oh yuck make that kind of stick out a little bit um one thing i like to do with my drop shadows is i don't always use black like this background is blue so i'm going to basically use a black but i'm going to keep it in the blue family like i'm not just going straight black just giving it that little bit of blue is just kind of like, I don't know if I can actually tell the difference, but I, I, I like it. Like that is a nice drop shadow. That is, a, that is a drop shadow that belongs. <laughs> Double dare. <laughs> yeah, too many colors. It was tripping me out. Like I couldn't tell if I was color correcting properly. <laughs> We are all the masters of our own mind, if not uh, professionals. So all the while, I'm also still looking at Netflix. Like I'm, I'm. It's 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 good to see what other people are doing in your realm. But the weird thing about this uh, show is it's animation and it's live action. So I definitely want to have a few versions of things that show that it's live action and animation, and this is going to be one of them. So I am don't want to over clutter it with stuff, but I like that he's looking at this microscope. I'm curious if we flip it the other way. Kind of, I like that negative space that's playing with the logo. It kind of fits pretty well. And then I can add an animated character right next to him. And I know he still has green on him and I need to fix the microscope and stuff. But for now, let's, um, let's just continue moving forward and I'll find a animated, uh, thing I like. <laughs> a helmet on. He does have some stuff that, uh, he has a helmet on. The poop episode. I think we saw a helmet. Uh, let's see, screen grabs, I'm looking at uh, screen grabs for the animation. Like there's this one I already have cut out. Like I wonder if, um, if I have the three guys. Yeah, I wish I made that logo. That logo's sick. Let me look, uh, cause each of the main characters is animated. <sighs> Let me see here real quick. Move stuff to go over. Where is my key art? Burp, 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 burp.
So I already made this in the past, um, but this can't be for Netflix because it's too busy. This is something else, um, but I already have those animated characters right here. And you see how I added in this splat, like, little science-y things? Like, that's not part of the show, that's just stuff I made. So let's see. Maybe I just want to use that. Is it too much? Is it too little? Is is it worth it? Should I take out a character? These are all questions that happen. Should the splat be somewhere else? Should it only be these characters? I kind of like it with just the animated characters, but that's not the main part of the show, so I definitely have to show live action. Uh, yeah, I know. It's crazy. There is a lot going on in this show. This show is so good. Like, I want more people to watch this show. It is a phenomenal show. I really like this. Like, I wish it was just the animated, but I know what my bosses are going to say. I know they're going to... You know what? I'm going to do this version anyway. We're going to do this version. I don't care. <laughs> I think it looks good. This is just really awesome. Let me just think about it. I know, I know. I'm thinking about it. I'm wondering. I'm wondering is... What are they going to say? I think it still has to have the live action. Because the main thing is the live action. If, if a kid looks at this, they're going to be like, what's going on? What's this live action stuff? But I love it. I love this. I'm going to save this as a version. I'm going to save, like, just another version. <laughs> I'm going to call it 2A and 2B. Yeah, just informed, yeah. Yeah, for sure. Khan, thank you so much. Please check out Young Khan. All right, let's uh fix that. Like if we like maybe I'll take out the ro no, oh, the robot's so dope. this on one side Look horizontal. this kind of tells an interesting story like this because um, he's looking at a piece of something and then those guys are right there and they look like kind of little gunky pieces of something. So let's see how we can do this. Maybe we move the splat. Oops, I didn't grab the uh, icons. Horizontal, maybe? Hmm.
Another horrible thing about getting screen grabs is sometimes they're only partial body. Oh, for sure, Khan. Oh, thanks, Juan. Yeah, we're not doing the wheel till next week, Friday. This was an emergency that came up, so we're doing this. But we'll have the wheel next week, as long as there's no other emergencies. Thanks for the follow, Barely. Appreciate that. You guys, Barely is also a graphic designer. Super fun stuff. He was even raising money for a great cause recently. That might still actually be going on. Um, check him out. I'm not allowed to post links in this stream, or I would. <laughs> Slow clap. <laughs> Yeah, you're gonna have to just uh, follow to find out what's gonna be going on. Um, since we are working from home and stuff, it's uh, kind of up in the air. But if you follow, you'll find out as soon as we do. <laughs> We are definitely missing some parts of his body. <laughs> kind of using them to hide behind. I don't want to break the beautiful line of his head. I like how that stands out. Because you got to think, like, if someone's watching on their phone, it's going to be a lot smaller. what we can do here, what we can manipulate. If you get rid of his hand, it'll look like he's looking at them. Oh, that is true. Actually, maybe let's just do that. Nerd news. Why are you so smart? <laughs> I like this. Good idea, nerd news. Thank you. You just saved me a bunch of time. Then I just need a color correction. Haha, <laughs> I like that. Thank you, Nerd News. Appreciate it. Nerd News, just take my job, okay? Just take it. I don't. <laughs> Something isn't showing, then yeah, maybe like there. Alright, now let's color correct his face. <laughs> it's okay. I can't do your job either. <laughs> Shadow's not working, so I'm gonna do my own. Um... Where are you? Oh, it's 
soft round brush. We're gonna do a super dark blue like how we did before. So it's basically black, but not. Mermaid month. Mermaid? Yes. Do we have any shows that have, uh, um, mermaids in them? <laughs> I like this. I can see a kid clicking on this. So this black is kind of just going a little too far into um, into the background, so we need to make it stand out a little bit. his face. I forgot about that. You'd click on it? Ah, oh, thank you. Yo, Chula, what up? What up? Good to see you. I love the number seven, by the way. Beautiful number. Ollie the dive. <laughs> Me too. I would totally click on this. Maybe one segment from a Bobby's World episode. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, dang it. Mermaids are too rare for Pavilion. We have squids. <laughs> That's what we have. <laughs> yeah, we do have Dive Ollie Dive one. It's true. Let me think. Um, yeah, let's get rid of that on its face. I hate color correcting. How do I want to do this? I'm gonna try something. You know what? I might just do. 
I might just do sensitivity happening. There we go. Let's do just a light, 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 light blue. Drop shadow is still a little much. we need to adjust these curves a little bit. And maybe, let's try this. There's just too much black going on, it was sort of distracting. And so this background then. know if I like that blue it's kind of crazy crazy blue let's go for a more no just gets rid of it okay that's good we have two versions now two versions I say two versions 
Captain, thank you so much for hanging out with us. Thank you for also showing your artwork in our Discord. I can't wait to see more. And anyone else who wants to share your fan art artwork in our Discord, I'll put it in a slideshow. <laughs> yeah, for real. And I don't want to move. I'm comfy. Yes, she is all cozy in her onesie. Ooh, euros. Sounds good. I haven't eaten yet. It should be related to Kabillion, but uh, Soul, Kabillion has Pokemon. I mean, uh, if you check out Kabillion.com, you'll see all of our shows. Any of those shows will we'll post that fan art. Unfortunately, our overlords have uh, rules we have to abide by. <laughs> But we won't be, yeah, we, we love to see your art. We, we love to, like, support you guys, supporting us, supporting you, supporting us, supporting you. And we'd love to share your artwork as well. And if you tag Kabillion on uh, social networks, we'll repost it if it's uh, fan art. Yeah, look how much uh, Captain did. Like, she did a whole bunch of Pokemon. She did some My Little Pony. She did some coloring pages. We have free coloring pages for those of you who don't want to draw and just want to color. We have tons of stuff. Check out kabillion.com forward slash freebies or our just start Discord. Okay, let's do one more concept um, and then um, I'm gonna log off and like go hardcore on this. <laughs> Um, I'm supposed to do five or six of them. I don't remember. I have to look. So number three. Do, 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 do. I'll be right back. I'm just going to use the restroom real quick. Um, I'm just going to close the window. You guys can look at the art. Because I'm just going to be a second. Here I'll be. I'm back from the shadows. Ooh, I'm haunting your screen. Just kidding, here I am. <laughs> Sorry guys, thanks about that. And catch you later, Captain. See you on Discord or the internets in general. Um, Just informed is lurking. Yeah, I love seeing your stuff, Soul. You have a way with shapes that are just phenomenal. Welcome back. Thank you, Soul. All right, we're gonna try one more idea before I have to really crank out some more stuff. Um, so we've kind of done two things. Uh, we did two different textures. Uh, one thing I'm seeing a lot on Netflix, um, cause you know, you always wanna see what other people are doing too, is uh, they kind of take a background and they make it a monochrome color. So like they'll take a, make everything green or whatever in the back. Um, 
so the character pops and uh, they kind of put a little opacity on it. I'm seeing that, so we are going to try that. Bum, bum, bum. Yes, saving is good. Let me make sure I did say that. Uh, yes, I have it. Okay, cool. Excellent. So yeah, if we do three, that's good. And then I just need to do two more off screen and then deliver that along with the characters I'm cutting out along the way and I should be good. Just the title large. Um, looking at Netflix, they don't really do that, but I like your idea. They sort of just rely on the characters. Oh, I see Kong, King of the Apes has a pretty large logo, but besides that... Oh, I'm looking at Pokemon Mewtwo Strikes Back uh, image and it's so sad. Look, this is the image they put for that. Like, is this a clickable image, guys? Is that clickable to you? To me, that makes me want to cry and go offline. <laughs> I don't know, that's, that's kind of weird. Yeah, I know. Why? Why? Why'd they do that? That's too sad. Okay, so I'm gonna look into my screen grabs again. I'm gonna try to find one that has a nice background where I can still um, like remove the character in a way. This one. Hmm. Maybe. They also have cool characters like this. Like these are characters. character in front of the character. I really like this pose where he's like talking to his sock puppet friends. <laughs> Ash had to socially distance himself. That's funny. Like this one, I can take, I could probably remove her and have like some kind of background. Let's see, let's look for more stuff. Hmm. This, I like the texture of the door. Maybe I have, there's another idea in here somewhere. Maybe there's another idea in here somewhere where I can take these doors and do something. Let's uh, take this door. And let's take this door. And we're going to set it aside on another layer until I figure out what I want to do with it. Maybe I won't do anything at all, but it's good to just have your elements. Yeah, like, I don't know, maybe we use one door. Like we're looking into. We can change the color of the door. We can put a drop shadow on the door. ideas cut out from the background could she be looking at him with the puppets take the doors pull them apart a bit put the logo in the middle with them below it mm, I see what you're doing okay let's see we'll be losing a lot of space on the left and right but let's just see maybe we just open it up like Yeah, and maybe, like you said, they're on either side. 
There were. I have a whole list, Juan. Let me see if I can just pull that up. Oh, I can't place it in here. Ah, I can't put it in this document. Yeah, I know. But I have a whole Word doc of everything that I was going to put on a wheel. So, let me go into my files. What did I want? I do like... I do like this. Like, that's kind of funny. Like, if I crop him out, put him there. Maybe open the door just a little more. But it's also... Uh, yeah, I don't like that he's wearing that suit. There's that. There's that. Can I get an image of... Like, I know the chick is... Um, the other main character, but... Like, we for sure want things that people will click on. So maybe it's him with the socks and the robot. Also, this is a cool uh, image of him with the beaker. Let me just put that aside. Shocked her on the other side. <laughs> but she's not wearing the right outfit in that. Oh yeah, maybe. Oh, she does have that. Hmm. Yeah, let's see what we can do. Let's first. Let's first get him, because I for sure want this pose for something. I don't know what. Oh, uh, he has those little. Ugh, it's that annoying hair again. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Whatever get it there's also this really cool head in a jar that's another character Let's see if I can show him to you I'll show him after welcome back Justin Takes a lot of work to get uh, hair looking like this. This one. Da -dum, da -dum, da -dum. Okay. Oh yeah, and his little hair here, and this little hair here.
They take sock puppets, <laughs> yeah. They did a great job on these sock puppets. They did a great job in the show. The show is like so underrated. I bet you there's like a group of cult followers of this show that are like, it's like right ass. show this. Mukbang, yes! It might be too gross for a mukbang. Monica was the same with the umbilical cord brothers. Yeah, Australia's got the fun stuff. Oh uh, yeah, it would be. It would be a challenge. Okay, so we got stuff to go here. Shadow for now. And see how we were just going through screen grabs and just going, you know what? I like that door. And look what's happening. Like, you never know what will happen. <laughs> I wonder. If we turned this, I don't know if this is the right background. I just want to see if turning this into some color. Cyan. <laughs> turning down the opacity. Yeah, I'm not sure if this is the right background, but we're gonna, I think, leave it for now. Is this the same? Yeah, that's that. What's this? Hmm. Like, there are clo- no. It's too much going on. That could be cool with the- the light. Hmm. Let's see. That is 40%. 40%. down show oh I've heard of that interesting I've heard of the upside down show and let's do filter blur Not sure if I like that yet or whatever, but we're just gonna hold on to it for now. Let's find a pose for her. Remove that. What's this? 
Yeah, I do like her like that, but the hand thing is unfortunate. So maybe, yeah, we could have her. Hmm. I wish she was facing camera. Let me look around. Because maybe we can still have that sock, but he's facing camera. Let me see. This one's great because he is facing camera. Since he's the main character, I feel that he should face camera. Because the girl facing the camera, it, it's it's almost like you're engaging with her first and he's secondary when that shouldn't be. But this is a nice straight on image that I found uh, in a screen grab. You can tell he used to have a uh, lip piercing. You can see it right there. <laughs> see how he used to have a, you can see right there. <laughs> and I know I could zoom in even further and stuff, but it's just not necessary for, for the original file size that this is. It's just a screen grab, so it's not super necessary. It can't be blown up that big, so no need to spend uh, more time where it's not needed. Especially with such a quick turnaround that we have to do with this. darken this brush as a mask to kind of give some let's change the brush settings to tilt with the brush no it's fine uh, shape dynamics angle jitter with pen tilt going on here. Oh, color dynamics is on.
Yo, what's up, Zara? <laughs> yeah. That's right. I, I know, this is unfortunately um, something that I almost didn't stream today um, because this had to be done. But he wanted to do it. And since I'm doing the work anyways, then it's okay. So I couldn't do the fan stuff today because I needed to do this. And if, if they saw me doing fan stuff, it wouldn't. They wouldn't be happy. So I'm doing the work that needs to be done. So if I went like this. a lot going on and we do something like As cool as it was having her on the other side, I think there was just a lot going on. some stuff to to Netflix but I had to get stuff approved first by Splash and so there was one episode that had a bunch of poop in it this show is called Oh Yeah and uh, here's some of the rejected screen grabs so uh, the main character flying on his toilet mobile with poop um, this one too where it looks like he's whispering to the poop that uh, definitely, definitely didn't make it. Um, there's one where he's up close and personal, examining the poop uh, over here. That that one was denied. That I, this is a good composition, but it was denied. Uh, I did not submit this one, but definitely, definitely wouldn't have worked uh, due to the poop. Um, there's also cartoon elements in it. Uh, this, this was not approved. Uh, and in the live action, uh, this also not approved. So, uh, just showing you. <laughs> yeah, nice emote. Totally. Totally. Um, I think the doors need to be green. I think we need a different background. It, like this one needs to look at it like this and I think this one Ugh, what's going on here floating hair yeah he 
can be looking at Septico while the other one is, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All animals do do. I kind of want him to like hold a beaker or something. Maybe we can take an arm from another episode. And uh, put it there. Let's see if we can find an arm. Maybe he's doing a thing. This might work. We got. Maybe this one? It might be too far away. Yeah, that might be too small. I don't think I can stretch that big enough. Um, there is also this. That could be funny. Let's see if I can just I'm just gonna do it really rough and see if it even scales big enough that it would work. And then I can make liquid pour out. That's not a problem. Let's do it rough and see. Kind of looks like a crazy person. Hmm. Not sure if that works, but let's hold on to it and uh, see if there's another pose we can use. Where's my music at? <laughs> Where's my music? Oh, there we go. Okay, let's find another hand. There's gotta be another one in here. Or maybe... Maybe it's doing an idea. Like, like that arm. Just quickly take it out. And just see if it works before we spend a bunch of time making it work. Here he has an idea like oh and that has a nice flow if you see this uh, flow how it goes like that it's a nice arch that's happening right there and then we've got um, we have a nice flow from here to here and then we have a nice negative space here that we can do something with the background I think this will be another one Um, this was a show that was done in Australia, and, um, we are putting it on Netflix. Yeah. So we have to deliver some stuff. Um, we have to deliver some key art and things. So 
So let me just see if they're, I still would love to have a beaker in his hand. Just gonna look through the other episode screen grabs and see if there's something in there. If not, the, the finger that's like the idea hand might work. Yeah, it is Rush. Yeah. <laughs> Submitted it, yeah, it is. It's technically fan art, totally. the time being. Let's just see if it works. Tiny baby hand! this better because it shows like it's more sciency and I can have like bubbles coming out of it yeah I think we're gonna go with this direction and then we got to change this background because I don't like it flip horizontal move that over yeah like it's looking pretty sciency like this change how blurred it is. It's a little too blurry. Yeah, I think like that is better. And then let's put a thing on top. Find a dark blue. No, you don't blame nerd news, you blame the overlord. <laughs> Troublemaker. Alright, let's uh, fix... What should we fix? Well, the sock guys are really blending in right now, which I don't like. So blue isn't the right color for the background. But before we go into a bunch of stuff... Um... I think the best thing to do is to fix the things we know that are staying. So like this hand. Let's fix it. behind it so that we can see. Actually, the layer should be not related to that color. It should be like something weird so we can see what stands out.
and let's paint this little thing out of here. So, Darth, thank you for uh, coloring in some coloring sheets. You might see them below on the uh, slideshow that we created. Thank you so much for that. Looks good. Freebies! Yes. <laughs> I'm a stinker. Nikki. <laughs> Actually, Nerd News uh, totally helped me out today. I accidentally was streaming on Twitch for Chameleon when I didn't know I was streaming. So <laughs> he called me up. Oh my gosh. That has to stop happening to me. Why do I keep doing that? Like, that's like the second time this week, I think, that I did that. I am not to be trusted. <laughs> Cool. And now let's uh, make it feel like it's uh, in the same realm by changing the curves on it. It looks a little too dark or something. Let's brighten it up a little. And brighten it. Cool. Okay, so that's good, and we know that's staying. Um, now to figure out the colors for the back. Strieger? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, maybe that was it. Sweet, Darth, nice. Look, they're right here, they're right here. <laughs> so let's uh, change the back first. Let's start simple, and um, actually, let's do this. Actually, solid color. I wonder if we do like a magenta. How that would look? Ooh, that's kind of nice. Let me look at the color wheel. Where is my color wheel? So. We have blue and red from the socks. Blue and red. Actually, green would be it. Green or like a purple. So yeah, this would work. Okay, I see. This is good. Yeah, maybe we do purple. Now let's take this background. the doors the doors don't vibe with it so if we're using that maybe the doors are green to go with the logo can we just do a hue shift on this I don't know if this works green don't really work. How's, so 
what? We want green. So it's gotta be blue. It does have to be blue, I guess just a different blue. Hmm. Okay. Let's play with this blue. Or it could be that just uh, the purple doesn't work. Maybe we change the purple to green. And the logo doesn't pop. Hmm. Maybe that's blue. Ah, oh, I like blue so much, but that character just does not stand out. We could change the sock character. Let me see what other characters there are. Oh, we have a really cool hookworm pirate. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, we have the guy. Hmm. Oh, so this is the other character, by the way. Let me find him. There's just a guy that uh, is a floating head. They would not want to see the poop. So there's this guy, he's really cool. That's not gonna work. Let's change this purple. Maybe it just needs to be darker. Oops. Green won't work. I wish blue worked, but it won't. Purple will work. I think I want to change the color in that beaker to be green. Let's see. Let's save our document. What is this? It's nothing. Doot, doot, doot. And change that. Maybe the doors can be green. Let's see what's going on here. Those are tough moves, guys. Real tough moves. Are you stoked about next week? Yeah. Did you guys mark yourself safe from Venom today? What are you talking about? What? <laughs> Should I? How do I know I'm safe, first of all? How do, how do you know you're safe? Yeah, blue is just so nice. Hmm. Like maybe we go purple like this, which is kind of like a blue. And then we change the beaker. Saturation. 
colorize. Turn that green. What do you guys, how are you guys feeling the purple? Is that weird? These people found these worms that when piled together looks like the Bendem symbiote. Oh, that's so awesome. But yeah, I would not want to be anywhere near that. That is crazy. Is purple too weird? Is this looking like the Joker? I, I really want this to be blue, but that guy like fades into the back. And like magenta is just too weird. Red, I don't know, it's not right. You like the Joker, but it shouldn't be. Oh, they're toxic. Oh, purple is not weird. Let me look at the color wheel again. Okay, if we have green, then blue is the next color. And red, your RGB, obviously. Huh. I could maybe use a different character. Change the doors again. Maybe it's just like that. Yeah, I think I think that's good. Leave the doors that blue. We got dark purple. All the characters are popping. We got green in there. We just need to remove the green from his hair and make that purple. Just take that out. Wait, what? Called bootlace worms. Don't look up if you're grossed out by worms. Thank you. I will not. Yeah. Boot centric. Oh, shoot. That's gross. That is gross. Um, let's find purple. Just kind of do that to the hair. Blur. Gaussian blur. blur. There's like tons of ways to do what I'm doing. We're just doing it this way. Multiply. Ah, it's still not getting rid of that. Let's try something else. Mm. 
Maybe hue saturation. Oh, wrong layer. <laughs> I'm picking green and it's not oh whoa that's weird nope not doing that nope and nope Ugh, thick mucus <laughs> why can't I just say find the green and remove it Go to highlights. That is too long. Good. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Why well, can't I just select green? Let's do this. Select color range. I need to look this up on Google how to do that. Yeah, I'm gonna look it up on Google how to just select greens and change them. I have a feeling it has to do with selecting the color range. Let me just try one more thing. Selecting that color range. Okay. And then changing the color balance. There we go. That's better. That's better. Let's do the highlights now.
and shadow. And then what we do is select everything except for the hair. Just delete it. Like this. And now as you can see, we removed a large amount of the green and then just minor tweaks will have to be done. But I think that's it for the stream today. Um, thank you so much everyone who's hung out and helped out and um, I think we came up with three really good designs uh, <laughs> so just to kind of go over what we did today these are the three we have let me move this so first we made this one I think I'm gonna add a couple of things to this then we made uh, this one. And thank you. I need to tweak the mirror a little bit to make it look more realistic. But uh, thank you, Nerd News, for helping out with that as well. And then we've got this one here. So we've got some three pretty cool designs. Thank you, Nerd News. I need to make two more designs, which I'll do off camera, but I need to eat. I'm um, sure a few of you do. And thanks again for hanging out. And have a great Friday, everyone. I've had so much fun doing this with you guys. I hope I can show you more graphic design stuff. But I promise, Juan, we will find a way next week, Friday. We're going to do only and all um, uh, fan suggestions. No, not cereal. You know that's my dinner. <laughs> ramen. I'm definitely going to have ramen. I love ramen. It's I can eat ramen all day long. The stream key. Nerd news, thank you. Right after, yes, that's the number one thing I need to do. That's funny. I, we're just, I'm just gonna prank you guys all month and, I, and you just won't know if I'm gonna stream on Kabillion, if I'm gonna stream Kabillion on Kabillion or am I gonna stream Kabillion on Lynn's Designs or vice versa. <laughs> thank you guys so much. Um, we're going to call it a day, but I wanted to thank Young Khan once again and anyone who's hung out still since Young Khan's raid. Thank you so much for coming through. We have really cool stuff for people who are subscribers. Um, we have um, these uh, certificates. So first time only, uh, people who subscribe to our channel, not only do you get some really cool emotes, but you get this certificate with a really cool sticker that we designed in stream. And tier two, first time gets this, which is another sticker, our derp sticker, that we designed live on stream, which is a hollow sticker. And Ligma Da Vinci designed the first time tier three subscribers t-shirt. We can all see in the panel. Um, head down to our Discord. Please post your fan art. It's super fun to see, and we want to be just showing your stuff everywhere. Tag Kabillion on stuff. Uh, we'll share it, and uh, we will catch you next week. Stay tuned. Follow the channel if you want to know what's up next. Only because since things... Oh, Dar, thank you so much for gifting Young Khan a sub. That's super nice of you. You've been so excellent to the stream. Thank you, Darth. And Darth is another streamer. Uh, he does recently, well, he plays, uh, he does play games, but recently he's been folding origami and it, doing an amazing job at it. So um, check him out. Um, let's support each other and uh, we will catch you guys next time. Bye all. <laughs>